I'm Dr. Walt Vogel. I'm the owner of Rocky View Family Dental and Implant Center. Here we will provide your participants at Sparta with a mouth guard they can use during the competitions. It's going to provide not only comfort so they don't have to worry about their mouth, but it's going to be much different than the mouth guards you're going to go buy at the local retail store. They're going to be balanced and fit properly to protect your teeth and your mouth so that injuries will be very minimal with this type of guard compared to something else that you would buy elsewhere or no guard at all. Ladies and gentlemen, our fourth bout of the evening is set for three two-minute rounds in the welterweight division. Let's meet our fighters. First, out of the red corner, please welcome Ramiro Figueroa! And his opponent, out of the blue corner, please welcome Anthony Torres! Ladies and gentlemen, let's meet our welterweight fighters first. Fighting out the Dynamic Mortgage Concepts Red Corner, an independent fighter from Denver, Colorado. Please welcome Ramiro Figueroa! And his opponent, fighting at Larry H. Miller Auto Group Blue Corner, from Denver, Colorado, representing Poor Boys Boxing, Anthony Primo Torres! Okay, fellas, you both received your instructions earlier in the dressing room. I want to make sure you obey my commands at all times. Protect yourself at all times. No strikes here to the back of the head. Nothing below the navel. Let's touch them up right now, fellas. Good luck. Bout four, kicking off tonight between Ramiro Figueroa and Anthony Primo Torres. Immediately, these fighters are going after each other. And I'll tell you what, being right there for the faceoff, Anthony Torres caught right in the face of Ramiro Figueroa. They look like they're ready to throw it down right then and there before the fight even started. And Primo Torres right now is... So far, the aggressor, but don't get it twisted. Romero Figueroa has definitely been throwing some big shots. Oh, Romero Figueroa now using some good jabs to check the distance. Big shot there by Romero. So far, Anthony Primo Torres, he is going for the knockout. He is trying to take Romero's head off. Primo Torres now getting Figueroa into the corner, and Figueroa escapes. Oh, big overhand right, almost connected by Anthony Torres. Both fighters now stepping away, being a little patient. Anthony Torres talking a little bit of smack. Big shots now by both of them. Once again, the overhand right 
by Anthony Torres, nearly connecting. I would not be surprised if that connects at some point in this fight, puts the fighter down. And that is the end of the first round, once again. This is Big Mo for Sparta Sports and Entertainment and Airtight Boxing, Combat Series number four. Got an incredible main card tonight of boxing. Hats off to matchmaker, veteran matchmaker, Mr. Steve Mestis. And let's check out this replay. You can see those overhand rights by Anthony Torres. So, so close to connecting flush. A little bit of blood looks like for Mr. Figueroa. And let's get it going with round number two. So far, much, much more patient by both fighters. They were trying to end it early in the first round, but now you can tell them starting to kind of feel everything out. Another massive overhand. Big lead hook by Mr. Figueroa there. A little bit of a, uh, leaking a little bit of blood there for Mr. Figueroa. Primo Torres trying to stay the aggressor, but definitely be more patient. <laughs> Once again, he was leading with that overhand. Oh wow, lots of blood coming out of Mr. Figueroa's nose. Nice combo there by Figueroa. Had him on the ropes for a minute, but Primo Torres got out. Ooh, big, there, there was the overhand that I was talking about. Big Rose got blood all over his face right now. But still staying aggressive. Still taking it to Anthony Torres. Got him on the ropes now. And that is the end of the second round. 66.666% done with this bout. So far, Mr. Figueroa seems very polished, very patient with everything. He's not trying to overexert himself, not trying to throw too much power. He's ready for his shot. Let's watch the replay here. Big uppercut grazed Figueroa there. Big combo had Primo Torres against the ropes. Getting ready for round number three. Let's see if our fourth bout also makes it to a decision. Ooh, big lead shot there by Mr. Torres. And Figueroa responds, wow, these guys are going at it. They are not trying to walk away from this. No more decisions. They are asking for it. They are talking smack in the middle of this ring. Wow, they are absolutely banging right now. And referee Chris Thasher had to I had, to, I had to split him up a little bit. I had to slow it down just a tad. Big, big hooks by Primo. And 
Anthony Torres trying to get Figueroa on the ropes. Very smart by right there by Figueroa when they were clenched up to push to the middle of the ring. Give yourself as much of an advantage as you can coming out of that clinch. Big shots by Figueroa. Primo Torres is visibly tired right now, mouth wide open, trying to get some air in those lungs. Oh, Figueroa is leaking blood once again like a nasty fountain. But he still is responding. He still is coming after Primo Torres. Ten second clacker. Do they end this bout with a flurry? And they do big hooks by both men. And that is the end of the bout. We'll be right back with the decision from our very, very dashing ring announcer in the ring in a moment. Ladies and gentlemen, after three full rounds, we go to the judges' scorecard for a decision. All three judges scored about 29-28, declaring you winner by unanimous decision, Anthony Primo Torres. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm joined in the very bloody red ring by our winner, Mr. Anthony Primo Torres. Anthony, prepping now with Poor Boys Boxing. What were you trying to, what were you trying to do going into this fight? Well, first off, we gotta thank God. He kept us both safe. You know, God's my best friend. I encourage you guys to talk to him. Right? Um, as far as coming into this fight, we know what we wanted to do. We wanted to go out banging and put on a show for everybody here. You know, I think we accomplished that, right? Now, as you progress in your career and as you move forward, what can we can expect next from you? Better conditioning, fighting all the way to the end, the way I did the first round, and, uh, and finishing with a knockout. Anything you want to say to your fans in the arena tonight? Yeah, I want to thank my coaches. You know, we've been working hard. I want to thank God even more, my wife, for supporting me. Hey, we'll be back again. Ladies and gentlemen, one more time for your winner, Anthony Primo Torres.